You missed these crazy secrets in Gorilla Tech's new mood update, and here is everything you need to know. So, if you enjoyed any part of this video whatsoever, then don't leave without hitting this massively sized white subscribe button and like the video as well for 100 years of good luck. Now, for those of you who do not know, Gorilla Tech has just had their giant Halloween update the second time around, and it brings a bunch of crazy new theories, leaks, and a bunch of new cosmetics. Now, if you look up in the sky, the first theory revolves around the moon. This is the first secret. Gorilla Tech added a new moon waypoint, which is up in the sky, and if you fly up to it, it is is fully 3D that you can actually see the forest, and going inside it does literally nothing. It's completely hollow, and there's nothing really to it. Oh my gosh, I'm flying. I'm falling. And that's because- Oh my gosh, I wanna- <laughs> And it's truly just because it's going to be a live event. This isn't actually going to be a map, as we know quite yet. The leaks really just point towards a new live event, which looks something like this. But before I press it, I need you guys to know one thing. I'm doing a giveaway on Stilt VR, an up-and-coming hand-based movement game kind of like Gorilla Tag, except instead of hands, you have stilts, but let Pass Nutor take over. Whoa, 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 you think you're going to watch the rest of the video without- without seeing me, it's future new tour here, and I wanted to tell you about something really, really cool that I got a chance to play a while back, and it's called Stilt VR. Stilt VR is an immersive, first-person, gorilla tag type game, but instead of gorilla arms, you have really bouncy stilts that bounce you around locomotionally anywhere you want, and I've played it a couple times, I made a video on it, which will be on screen. In there, I tried out Stilt VR, it was amazing, amazing experience, and I'm giving you guys the one-time opportunity to get 50% off your purchase of the game on any platform meta and steve yard um with my code which is new tour and a bunch of random numbers it'll be in the description and if you go into my discord right now you'll have a chance to win one of the five free copies that i'm going to be giving away and the giveaway is done on october 28th which is literally six days away and you guys don't have much time so go and enter it right now with my discord link in the description down below and good luck because this new update in still VR is going to be hype now the moon update is truly a magnificent sight for the average eye and i'm actually the superior eye as you can see i'm all seeing if you do press the live button which is on a pad that i'm controlling as you can see you will notice a truly magnificent sight as you can see the moon map gets really really big and it has a giant eyeball that looks all the way around forest the same direction uh that i'm looking actually although i didn't mean moon map i meant the moon event, moon event. so it's a very hyper hyper colored bright vibrant a uh, moon but the funniest part is everything else is gray and dark uh so that's the only bright part and then once the live event actually happens in the game there'll be a couple of new things two new brooms that you see flying around as well as two new witch witches that'll fly around at the top of the map and the flower cauldron which we saw last year in last year's update it was right here and you would literally just chuck flowers in it i also posted a video on exactly what the live event's gonna be so you guys can go check that out but that's one of the giant things that you might have missed now while we're waiting for this uh giant live event to just kind of die down i'm gonna head to a city to show you guys the next thing you might have missed oh my gosh the low gravity is killing me guys there is low gravity in the live event and guys just so you know this live event is gonna be friday october 25th which is this week guys so get strapped in get ready and get hyped because i think a roll tags new halloween live event update is going to be the best update ever so as you can see as i'm heading towards city you'll notice almost nothing new with decorations because there truly is not any new decorations in that path but once you get to city there's a bunch of new things and the first is on top by the new arcade map you head up to the arcade map you'll notice to the left of it a giant magician booth which you can actually activate by pressing this get fortune button right here and when you press it you'll get a brand new fortune and the magician will think for you it must get free now one thing i forgot to tell you guys is the magician's fortunes are usually simple and nice but as soon as the moon of event occurs, it'll give you very, very, very cursed messages, like it must get free. Now, these are not normal ones, but since the moon event is now gone and I deactivated it, as you can see, the moon ba is back to being cracked, I should be able to get a normal fortune. Yeah, see, branching paths uncertain, it's just a normal one. And Girl Tag also added a bunch of new things to the city, like these really cool glowy eyes, a bunch of pumpkins, a bunch of skeleton ghosts, same one as last year up there, and some really cool wall art, like these uh, graffiti right here, and these new wobbly ghosts, like blow up ghosts. And this is what I'm, what I usually do to my subscribers, guys. Mm. Okay, you did not. They also released these new Mookie Madness 2, like, random cosmetics that actually don't work. I'll show you right now. If you go to purchase them and you actually go to the item shop, which is right here, guys. When you select one, they're literally nowhere to be found. You can't pick them up. You literally can't do anything with them. Which makes me think Gorilla Tag needs to fix these, but that might have been something you missed. My favorite, my personal favorite cosmetic secret of this new update is the Headless Pumpkin. Don't know what I mean by Headless Pumpkin. And I have a floating coconut. This is my head, guys. Um, what the Sigma? And you can literally just chuck it anywhere and it'll go back on your head. It's like Thor's hammer. 
So if I chuck, if I chuck my head off like this, it'll literally just come back like Thor's hammer. As you can see, it literally made an effect where it came back. That's so cool. Like, let me chuck it. Oh my gosh, it comes back. So yeah, my head doesn't like being detached for long. Make sure you like this video because it took me a while to attain all of these really, really cool secrets, including the leaks that I'm going to show you in a second. Uh, but, but, but first, but first I want to show you a couple new things that I want. The other one is a map change that isn't just like a normal, like artwork or anything like that. It's an actual map change that's going to be leading to live event. I'll show you that right now. The first one I'd like to show you guys is in forest and it's on top of stump. Now, for those of you who've already watched my past videos, you'll know where I'm going with this. But on top of stump, there's this really, really cool centerpiece. I don't really know what to call this. It is almost like a, if you've ever played Minecraft, then there's these really, really cool beams that shine into the sky. That, that's what this reminds me of. I don't know what they're called, but I'll put a picture on screen. And that's what this thing is going to be doing. On the 25th of October, 2024, we are going to be getting to see these well, I can't say these yet. I can't spoil it. But this thing point at the moon and it's going to it's going to literally just have a bunch of lightning come out. And so the live event's going to be scaring players. But then these things will all turn at once and simultaneously break the moon. And I know I just said these and simultaneously. I'm going to show you the other ones right now because there's not just one, guys. There is two, three and four with a really, really cool arms crossed skeleton. Looks like he's about to make a deal with the devil or something. Not me, guys, not me. But as you can see, this is a really, really cool. Another one. So all these are actually going to line up to the moon. As you can see, each map that has these, you can actually see the moon from, meaning that each of them are going to have a chance to shoot up at the moon and completely destroy the moon monster, which is going to be shining down on us on October 25th, like I said, and uh, they're going to be basically helping us destroy the moon monster, because the moon monster is not nice, and it's literally just staring at us. It's basically having a staring contest, but if it was menacing. So if you guys are hyped for this, let me know down in the comments, and also let me know down in the comments if you're going to be getting on on October 25th. Say yes, I'm going to be getting on, or no, I'm not going to be getting on, because I want to know how many people there's going to be online, and maybe I'll do a big stream. Let me know if you guys would like to see a stream. Another thing you might have missed is a new game mode called ghost tag it's almost the exact same as the camo tag where you once you get tagged you're invisible except you're completely invisible when you're tagged and once you get tagged from a tagged ghost you actually get jump scared i'll show you guys that it's soon but for now let me show you a couple more secrets these skeletons behind me these skeletons behind me right here resemble i don't actually know what it's called basically it's a uh, halloween thing where this means hear no evil speak no evil and see no evil it's something to do with like the devil i'm, I'm pretty sure uh that but i just know that that's what it's called because some guy showed me in the lobby. Another cool thing that came out a couple weeks ago now, but I'm sure lots of you guys would know now, is the new game modes that you can actually play if you go in here. This is the virtual stump, where you can play a bunch of random really cool maps, like an only up map and a bunch of other cool maps made by creators. And I'm sure that you guys have already seen this because I made plenty of videos on this in the past. And I actually think, didn't this come out before the Halloween of thing? New tour, you're stupid. What the Sigma? And that's all the biggest secrets I could memorize before recording this video. But now I'm going to go into some ghost tag and just show you like one round and how it looks and how it feels and everything. Thing. And I don't know why my game sounds so like bummy, but that's weird. Who, who's not tagged yet? Who's not tagged yet, boy? Ow. Oh, also, when you're in ghost mode, you can see literally everything that you can't see in normal mode, like these giant spiders climbing everywhere, and literally a bunch of other cool things like this skeleton, this big skeleton, this one that's camping out in the tunnel with the other one. I'll show you. Are you guys trying to spawn Lucy right now? What the Sigma? But yeah, the last guy, I don't even know where he is. Where's the last guy, everybody? I see you, dude, but you're not the guy I'm looking for. I'm looking for someone who isn't tagged. He's probably hiding. I'm not gonna lie. Well, I don't think we're gonna take him, but this was the ghost tag mode that I was talking about. And like, there's a lot of really cool things you can do in it. So that was basically about everything I wanted to show you about this mode. And I'm gonna try and get tagged. The heck? The heck is that spot? What heck is that sound? What is that sound? Lucy, why is there an ant on there? It's red Lucy. What the Sigma? Yeah, guys, if you um if you spawn Lucy from this gravestone, you'll actually get Red Lucy, which is really, really cool. And yeah, that, that's Red Lucy right there. Oh my gosh, run away from Red Lucy. What the heck, dude? This is real footage of Red Lucy. What the heck? Please don't get tagged. Oh my gosh. Run, dude. Run, dude. Bro, run. Hurry. Oh my gosh. What the Sigma? Dude, it's getting faster. It's getting way faster. Run. Run, dude. Oh my gosh. But I wonder what this would look like with the live event. I'm kidding. I'm not going to do that in the public lobby. What the Sigma? Bro's better get caught by red. Lucy, what's gonna happen? Okay, it's just a normal animation. Cool, though. Everything gets a lot more red. And this is what it looks like when you get tagged. It's a giant jump scare. So I hope you guys all enjoyed, and as always, I will see you later.